Hi everyone, Dr. Murat here with Elite Sports and Spine Chiropractic. A lot of people come to our, into our office with shoulder pain. There's a lot of different things that can cause shoulder pain, whether it's muscle related, there's a couple different joints within the shoulder, uh, there's a labrum in the shoulder, there's people with what we have, this is a rotator cuff, which is a group of muscles within the shoulder, uh, there's impingement, there's fractures, there's all kinds of things that can go on in the shoulder. Um, so stay tuned, we're gonna go over a quick assessment and uh, some treatment options for different shoulder diagnosis. All right, now we're gonna go through uh, one of the quick assessments that we do for shoulder pain to look for range of motion to see if it's muscle related, tension, uh, joint related, things like that. Uh, this one's called Apley's test, Apley's back scratch test. Uh, so I'm gonna have uh, the patient go through a uh, specific range of motion. We already explained what he's gonna be doing, so he's just gonna show you on both sides. I want you to see the comparison from one side to the other, where we have, so this side would be about this much uh, difference in the fingertips. If he switches to the other side, you're gonna notice it's a big difference. We got about maybe a foot uh, a difference on that side. So that shows us that there's a limited range of motion within the shoulders uh, from that test alone. Sometimes there's pain associated with it or sometimes people can't even reach their hands back there. Uh, and that gives us an indication of what types of things are going on with, with the, the muscles and the shoulder. Uh, if there's joint problems, if there's muscle problems and other things like that. Uh, so that's one that you can also try it at home, see if you can even do that. If you have pain in the shoulder, then there's probably something going on. All right, so some treatment options for the shoulder. Oftentimes, uh, we see the shoulder connecting with the thoracic spine, so uh, there's oftentimes some restriction within the thoracic spine, so lack of extension within that area that causes uh, a, a direct correlation with some shoulder pain and restricted range of motion in that area. So we'll do some adjusting uh, into the thoracic spine for the patient, uh, as well as uh, them go into the shoulder and doing a little bit of soft tissue mobilization into that area, so I'm gonna have the patient uh, the shoulder up like this, I'm really pressing into the area uh, of restriction in that area, the muscle that we want to do a little bit of release on, and he's going to actively move uh, his uh, arm and shoulder through a specific range of motion that we uh, already told him to do. Uh, another thing that we'll do, oftentimes with shoulder pain, there's a lot of inflammation. Uh, some people have impingement in the front of the shoulder, that's an inflammatory condition. So we'll end up doing some laser treatments uh, to that area to help decrease the inflammation and accelerate the healing process of those tissues that may be damaged.